Hello everybody and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays Sunless Sea. Last episode we ended at Fallen London here having uh, run a couple missions and now we're going to figure out what we got from them. This is not something I've ever done before so this is all brand new to me. Uh, we have warm congratulations from the Blind Bruiser here. Welcome home. You may ask how it is I'm here to meet you and I may remark that we have eyes in the wastes and eyes in the hill. In fact we have more eyes then, uh, not Oracle, and they're, they are all glad to see you, and of course your cargo. So I dropped off, I took his thousand echo payment and brought it all the way out uh, to wherever we were, I don't remember where it was. Brought it back, with, brought back the cargo, and we're going to hand over the cargo and claim our payment. Oh, very good, very good. Please accept this small token of my thanks, and please also accept my thanks. Interesting, I like that sentence. <laughs> And uh, my patrons' thanks, which uh, we, being uh, persons of honor, will un uh, what understands the true nature of dealings is much more important. Basically, his thanks to me is more important than the gold. I lost the un the bottled souls that were unmarked. I gained 200 echoes. I got paid. And you're collecting cargo for the cheery man quality. He's going, okay. Let's see if we can get a tattoo yet. No, we don't have anything there. Uh, let's visit the Dark spect Spectacled Admiral and submit a port report. No, uh, I guess I didn't have anything to give him. I thought I did. Submit chart, do 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 do. Ask him what he needs. I think I still have a mission to visit a um, port for, for, for him. So let's go over to London. Uh, hull is okay. Crew is fully stocked. We have three officers. We have a shady cook. We have a chief engineer, and we have a first officer. Very good, very good, very good. Let's visit the university. Uh, oh yes, the university's maritime liaison whispers breathly. Oh yes, this is quite a tasty one. Let me explain to you. He or she explains, teeth glittery. I did this uh, with my first playthrough, some of this antiquarian stuff, basically just trade knowledge or secrets for um, you get uh, increase in pages, which is this one right here. Pretty low. Apparently I'm stupid. All right, let's leave the university. We can carouse the docks. I really need to get this down. <sighs> Dry dock. We could offer passage to tomb colonists. We can see who awaits me. All right, now I have a, I need a surgeon and a gunnery officer. It's an engineer gunnery officer. Here we go. Engage an officer, the Presbyterian, or not Presbyterian, Pres, uh, Presbyterate Adventurous. Afternoon, Captain. Looking for a gunnery officer? I'd like to help you blow up some monsters if you'll have me. Increase iron veils. 50 echoes. That sounds good to me. Continue. So we'll go to our officer's page. And drag in our gunnery officer. Almost have a full crew now. All I'm missing is a surgeon. Nice. Look at my, look at my iron seventy one. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. So anything else to do here? We should do. Oh my god! I forgot. I completely forgot about that. Oh, it's a good thing I didn't spend any more of my money. I forgot that we ran out of food. Okay. Um. Shops. I forgot where I was going with that. Not supply. Here we go. Buy some some of this. I need fuel, of course, as well. <sighs> How much should I buy? All right, fourteen and seven. I guess that's okay. That that'll have to do the trick. <sighs> now I know they wanted me to gather information. From Polythreme, somewhere a good way east of London. Oh, and I do have this nightmare strength of two because my terror was so high when I got back. <sighs> Just trying to think of what I should do. Okay, let's take a look at our. No, not that. Let's take a look at our map. It said somewhere due east. What I'm thinking is going to be the best thing for me to do is head down over this way and start exploring this area over here. So I think when I got over here, it said it was not an area not in the game yet. So I think I'm going to head down here and start heading off that way. Whew, okay. 
a little nervous because I'm now officially out of money and I don't know where I'm going. I do have a good crew though and I have some upgraded weapons. I'm hoping my high iron skill will keep me alive. If I need to, I can start attacking um, monsters and stuff and trying to, you know, get food and stuff from them. It's just this, t this terror being so high makes me really nervous because my terror getting up to 100, I think, is what did me in last time. Let's just kill this guy. Let's kill him. Let's fight him. Shouldn't be a problem. Shouldn't be a problem at all. Let's light him up. Uh, my, when my terror got to 100, tentacles started... Well, I think it was tentacles. I'm not sure if that's actually what happened. But I started getting... People started, you know, jumping overboard or something like that. I'm actually going to check, do my evade to see how far away I can get him now. So he's going to move in 30 yards. 38. So that went up higher than it was before. This should do him in. He's only got 5 health. Boom. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. Butcher him for supplies or dissect him for knowledge. Let's butcher him for supplies. Lost 1,500. Hunger. Okay... Um, well, I've got a lot of exploring to do, so I think what I'm going to do is either, um, depending on how this goes, I'm either going to uh, time compress this or maybe just cut it out and, and we'll fade back when something interesting is going on. Well, here's something interesting. A Zaylor has run mad. She roams the ship, cudgel in hand, smashing comrades to the deck. She cries, he is angry. Oh, he is angry. I could shoot her dead. A straightforward challenge. 100% chance of success. I could try to talk her down. 16% chance Ark can try to capture her alive. Hmm. Let's try to capture her alive. Futile, futile. She's quick and strong and merciless. She brings another Zaylor down in a trailing spray of red. I lost the storm's attention, I lost a crew, and I failed the challenge, so someone died. Oh, do I still have to do this? Let's just... I guess we'll just shoot her then. She killed two people and I killed her. Wow, just lost three crew members. Look at that. That's why yeah, I gotta make sure I keep extras. Got a Conate ship following me. Or, what? Let's go fight him. Let's go fight him. Gotta, gotta do something interesting this episode. I fought a Conate ship once before and it didn't prove to be a trouble. Alright, they have a strong hull and a large crew. So let's, uh, let's light them up, and then I'm going to evade them. Keep the distance. I got my illumination up to 44. Okay, their illumination is better than mine. So I'm going to evade them. Get that down. They're going to go towards me. Take a wild shot. They missed. I lit them up. I'm going to evade them again. They're going to use a potent flare. And then I'm going to open fire after this. Evade, potent, or and I'm gonna start opening fire. Potent flare, flank speed quicker than evade and increases distance more. Okay, they're gonna try to move away from me now. So I hit them, and I'm gonna fire on them again. They're gonna try to evade. 65. Okay, too far away now. So let's get. Oh no, the illumination is so low. I just keep using these potent flares. We're really far apart from each other. So that's almost high enough. So uh, they're trying to keep the distance too. Last time they tried to get in really close. Let's open fire again. All right, now they're gonna try to move in. My illumination is so high. I mean, I don't. Maybe they need. Maybe they're out of range or something. Because this is what they tried to do before: is just keep moving in, keep moving in, keep moving in. Let's take an observation. See if we can get anything out of him. They're gonna move in. They're going to do a... Oh, look at that. Illumination down again. Did I miss that? I may have missed that. Because, um... I don't know if I got the observation or not. I'm trying to look in here. Cancelled action, not eligible. Yeah, they, um... I couldn't see them anymore. I, I think the illumination got so low that I couldn't see them anymore and I didn't get to the, the observation. Let's try the observation again, because one more shot should do them in. So I'm going to try to get as much information as I can. Observing the foe, plus two, now two. All right, let's just try to, cause, cause I'm, I'm in the, I'm in the clear here basically. I'm gonna try to keep, um, keep getting these observations. See if I can get some nice information. Now eight. 
So let's throw up another flare because they're going to move down. They're going to they're going to illuminate me, and then I'm going to do another observation again. It's a Colton flare observation. I didn't. Oh, you know what? I just realized. Maybe this is placeholder artwork because it's. I just realized they were the same. Launched a flare. Now ten. I think. Let's do one more because I think ten is what you needed to be at. Let's launch for one more, and then we'll, we'll then we'll take them out. Okay, that's good. It should do them in. There we go. Sunk them. Very good. Very good, very good, very good. We could seize and loot her. We could let her go, or we can record any observations. You've gained enough, you may learn something. So let's just do that. The war, uh, uh, Trimoran defeated. Shattered, listing, seize what you can. If you've gathered anything. Tactics, maneuvering, weapons, so similar, and that's so different, you can learn from this. I gained 15 knowledge fragments. Is that it? Oh, I, I, I thought I wouldn't be able to do anything else. I can season looter or I can let her go. Let's just season looter. Uh, white and golds are watching you from the... Oh, that's because I seized their ship. They don't like me, but they, they were aggressive too. I have a cache of curiosities. Bolt of spider silk. I can sell that later. That was a success, I would call it. Uh, I got some information, which was great. I got some goods, which I can sell off later. Ooh, what's down here? So, uh, I think I think that was it. All in all, a success. I didn't lose any crew. Well, in that combat, I didn't lose any hull. They didn't even get a shot off. I discovered Godfall. What the hell is Godfall? Well, let's put it into port here. Aw, damn! Questing tentacle. This is what did me in last time. Lost a crew member. It's this terror. It's so high. The brawling bearded men who live here call themselves monks. They pay lip service to Saint Stalactite, which fell from the roof, but their chief interest seemed to be wine, blood, and... So this is a giant stalactite that fell from the roof. Okay... I guess we can't do any of this stuff. I can of shouting. Let them tell you about past and present events in the monastery. They're eager to talk about their history. The stalactite, they assure you, was one of the citadels of the starved men who dwell in the roof. When it fell, a few of its occupants survived to become the monks' uh, progenitors. How does that work, you wonder, with their vow of cel celibacy? <laughs> they some only met the all men. Uh, survivors who don't have sex somehow manage to procreate. They become vague and are suddenly eager to speak of the death of passing shipping. I got a port report from here. There's nothing here. Nothing to do here. I'm a little nervous now because I think I might need to head back. I didn't find what I needed to find. I got those... I, I lost three crew members. I got those questing tentacles. And that's really bad because the questing tentacles are just going to keep snatching people off the, off the deck of the ship. And eventually I won't be able to make a good speed. And that will probably mean my death once again. I do not know how to keep this terror down. I mean, I, I think the doing the carouse, the wolf stack docks things gets your tear down, but it costs like 30 echoes. It's a fortune, really. This under part of the undersea has not been created. Check back in a later build. Ugh. I keep running into that, so I know all this stuff is going to be built eventually. It's just not in the game yet, but like I said, it's an early access game. The next update is going to be focused on combat, so they're not. I don't think they're going to be added in anything here. Let's st stop into this light ship here. Terror 98. Sailors praying. Restless nights. In the watches of the night, you pad softly past the hatches of the crew quarters. Alright. I lost one terror. Like, all these things seem to, like, like, you can gain 50, like, like 30, 40, 50 terror in 5, 10 minutes out at sea, but any of these things only seem to reduce your terror by one at a time. Ah. Lost two. So now I'm down to 95. Nothing more to do here. 
Nothing more to do with the light ship but to continue on. Alright, well I'm going to explore a little bit more and try to make my way back to Fallen London so I don't end up dying. I don't want to lose this crew. Oh, I've been doing so good. Oh, shit. Mutiny! Fear and despair have destroyed the loyalty of your crew. Half of those who remain have taken up arms against you. You've taken shelter in the bridge while their shots ring out around you. Cut them down. Cowards! Villains! Damn them all! Failure means your game is over. It's a low-risk challenge. I have an 85% chance to, uh, of success. I can attempt to win them around. Which is an almost impossible. I gotta go with this one. A costly victory. A haze of blood and gunfire, screams and imprecations. A man you knew with your knife in his heart. Rather quickly it's over and you stand panting and victorious. You are much fewer, push the corpses of the mutineers into the sea and press on for what little time remains to you. I lost 50 terror. And I lost 4 crew. So, basically my entire crew is gone. This is awful. Alright, we put it in this new port, the Salt Lions. Oh, this is going badly. I gotta get back to, to Fall in London, but look at my crew! It's down to two! Okay, well, I think I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna call it an episode here. This has not been going well, and we'll pick it back up in our, our our limp back to fall in London to see if we can survive this. I don't know if I can. I have such I have so little echoes remaining to hire on more crew. Anyway, if you've enjoyed this, drop me a like, leave me a comment, and if you're interested in more Benjamin Magnus plays Sunless Sea, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next time.